Hey guys, meteorologist Chris Tomer here. Let's talk some mountain weather. My first stop is in the Sierra to kind of see how things are going through this uh, this first surge. The next surge comes in late 313. Um, so it's on its way, but let's just see how this one's going. Um, so this is Palisades Tahoe. They're reporting 16 inches in 24 hours, base temp of 28. In the last seven days, 84 inches. Um, and they're expecting delayed um, delayed openings today on many of the lifts at Palisades. Um, in Kirkwood, 12 and 24, they've got 78 inches in the last seven days, and they were expecting to open today after being shut down yesterday, uh, but I'm sure there are a number of delays in trying to open today. Um, so 30, I think, is there, yeah, 30 degrees. So dealing with some issues with snow levels, my forecast for snow levels today up to 7,100 feet rain snow line on Monday 7,400 feet so it actually goes up tomorrow as that next surge approaches and by Tuesday the rain snow line is at like 8,400 feet so it's going to be very high on Tuesday rain and snow will be an issue at almost all the resort base areas across Tahoe again today 7,100 feet 7,400 feet Monday 8,400 feet on Tuesday and then it will then it will go down after that all right here are my bullet points so next day our surge comes in late 313 continues into 14 and then tails off on early 15 so that'll be a big one for the Sierra again very high snow levels um, and then another storm is lined up with a very fast jet I'll show you that coming up for 319 320 321 it'll come in pretty fast um, in the northeast, you've got a one main storm system during the period, late 313, 314, early 315, and maybe some light snow on 318. So I've got some storms on both coasts here. Um, while I'm just thinking about it, let me show you the jet. So this is uh, the forecast jet for 319, very late in the day. You can see that powerful jet core sitting over the Pacific that's helping to escort in that next storm system. So after this next AR surge, we'll wait, and then that would be the next storm system. Um, three, late 318, 319, 320, 321 across the west in general, riding that fast jet stream, that uh, streak. Um, so let me just uh, show you kind of what we're looking at here as far as the forecast goes for the radar and the satellite. So this is uh, Monday morning, early, and you can see we're fragments of snow across the west. But here comes the next AR surge, late 313, 314, traverses the west, hits Colorado, Wyoming, Utah, and northern New Mexico, and then it's out of here. Then it's a waiting game for the next storm system. And here it starts to throw in a little bit of moisture on 317, but really we'll have to wait. 318, 319, 320, 321, that's when that next storm system would roll into California and across the west. And you can really see the AR surge coming here in the SCEFs integrated vapor transport right there th late 313 314 early 315 and then that's it and then just some low level noise coming in with that next storm 318 319 and 320 all right let's go back to um, the numbers for all of this so my forecast all of today through 314 um, quite a quite a bit of snow there obviously late 313 314 in the uh, the Sierra 20 to 30 inches for Tahoe down to Mammoth Moore and Shasta about five to six for the Tetons and the Wasatch during this period and in Colorado one to four inches will likely do it all right period two 315 through 321 you're capturing really this next storm system in California uh, which would be 318, 319, 320, 321, somewhere in there. And then it would move across the west with about 6 to 12 for the Wasatch and Tetons. And look at Colorado. It spins up to a nice storm system, and it really does hit in northern New Mexico pretty nice there with uh, probably 14 to 18 inches. And in Colorado, about a foot for I-70 north, 1 to 2 feet for the western slope in southwest Colorado, looking pretty good right there. All right, in the northeast, again, there was one main storm system, late 313, 314, 315, where we're going to get probably 90% of these numbers that you see. Um, and then there's another chance of some light snow on 318. But generally, most of that snow, late 313, 314, and 315. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this uh, update. I hope, I hope everybody's having a great Sunday. Always appreciate you tuning in here, and take care.